Tonight, drama in downtown Phoenix today, where a utility regulator proposed slashing compensation payments to rooftop solar homeowners. The last minute proposal had Arizona's home solar industry up in arms. Team 12's Joe Dana here tonight with a surprising outcome. After sending shockwaves through the solar industry the last couple of days, Commissioner Nick Myers took it all back, withdrawing his proposal. Thank you very much. One after another, business owners of Arizona's massive home solar industry thanked Commissioner Nick Myers, not for anything he did, but for what he did not do. Two days earlier, Myers blindsided supporters of home solar, filing a proposal to reduce the rate that utilities like APS pay to rooftop solar homeowners for their excess energy. Those purchases help make solar more enticing. Myers proposed much steeper reductions than already planned for to kick in September 1st. And giving the market no time to respond to that, it just doesn't make any sense at all. In front of a packed house of solar advocates, Myers backed off his proposal, but not without taking jabs at the industry. If an industry that is 15 or 20 years old cannot survive without a subsidy, how bad of a business model is that? Solar advocates say Myers mischaracterizes the issue. I urge our leaders here to think more and do better. They are asking commissioners to create policies to speed up the transition to solar, not slow it down. APS has a whole one-page summary on their clean energy commitment, stating how they want a 65% clean energy grid by 2030. How is this going to happen? with such rooftop solar killer policies. This is not over. The commissioner wants to revisit this issue in October. A hearing is scheduled to discuss solar value in the future. Joe Dana, 12 News.